Owen was born uh, November 9th, uh, 2000, right? Obviously it was a great day. My wife and I were delighted. It was a delightful day and a regular birth. He could be quite cantankerous, but loving at the same time. So he was kind of fire and uh, brimstone sometimes, but other times he was just an absolute uh, delight. My mother gave this bike to Owen. It's called Little Princess. Owen obviously wasn't a princess. He was a boy. He was a prince. And we told him that it was, you know, a girl's bike called Little Princess. But to him, it didn't matter. It was a bike. Owen loved riding his bike because he saw his parents riding their bikes all the time. By the time Owen was three or four, he was riding his bike, you know, here in our house. He would do this little circuit uh, on his bike that had training wheels, and he would ride around and have a grand old time. It started off very gradually. We just thought he was having uh, like a, a bout of diarrhea and the flu, and he would be fine for, you know, four or five days, and it would happen again. And we went to a Medi Center, and the first response was, oh, yeah, he's had diarrhea for two or three weeks. And it's probably nothing serious. Keep an eye on it. Eventually we go to emergency because the stomach pains are, you know, very, very strong and causing him a lot of discomfort. And uh, basically turned away from uh, emergency as well. We're told, keep an eye on it, just like we've been told before, keep an eye on it. Not sure what it is, you know, maybe come back for some tests. That was a Saturday. The next Friday, he's on the operating table being operated on and diagnosed with Burkitt's leukemia. When he was finally diagnosed with cancer, the healthcare was spectacular. I just wish the doctors that saw him the first and second and third times were a little bit more curious. And uh, instead of just saying, eh, it's diarrhea, probably nothing, obviously it was something. When he was first diagnosed, we sat down with Owen's uh, oncologist, and the doctor actually said to us, he said, yes, it's cancer, but I've got good news. It's a type of cancer that's highly treatable, 90 to 95% cure rate. Owen's initial treatment went very well. He went into remission as per the schedule, and he was in remission for two or three months, and then he had a relapse. With this type of leukemia, if you relapse, then the chances of surviving go from 95% to 20. Owen's last day was particularly uh, powerful. He knew he was going to die. He was six years old, and he knew that he was sick, and he knew that there could be problems. So, you know, uh, his last, actually the night before, um, he was fairly lucid and conversational, and um, he said, um, am I going to come back? Which is a fairly profound thing to say for a six-year-old. And my wife said, well, you know, some very smart monks think you will. And so, you know, we had a, a great time with him that night, but in the morning he was, um, well, at first we thought he was just sleeping, but he was basically unconscious, and then he over the course of that, that day, his breathing got more and more labored, and then by 11.30, you know, he took his last breath. Every time I, I go drive by that Medi Center, I want to go in there and just say to that doctor, you know what, you were wrong. So my advice to parents who have, you know, kids who just have the flu or whatever, is to ask as many questions as possible. Well, we always have this bike. Yeah, I think we will.